make it exciting. Is it exciting? Oh, okay. Are you, you not excited? I'm not sure. I'm a bit worried I'm <laughs> going to say the wrong thing and you'll be totally embarrassed of me rather than the questions. Yo, guys, what is going on? It's your boy, Toon Gaming here. And stay tuned because today we're doing a Q&A with my mum. So, yes, guys, we are doing a Q&A today with my mum. And I am honestly terrified on what she's about to say today. Just want to say a huge shout out to the community for making this possible. We smashed that community challenge. And that's why we're bringing you this Q&A today. I honestly cannot think of anyone more else in my life that could not embarrass me any more than mum. But guys, before we get into the video, if you're wondering why I'm sitting here in this lovely Looney Tune Udi, then you can get yourself hold of one right now. I recently done a collaboration with the Udi and I have a code here to get 30 pounds, dollars or euros off an Udi. You guys can use it right now. All you guys have to do is literally head over to their website, find an Udi that you love, that you like, that you want to be comfortable in. And when you go to check out, put the code Tune Gaming in and there you go. 30 pounds, dollars, euros off of your order, just like that. Right, let's not waste no more time. Let's get embarrassing tune. I'm going to get my mum in here. And yeah, guys, um, enjoy the video, man. Like, comment and subscribe. Yo, people, what is going on? It's your boy, Toon Gaming here. And as you can see, we have Mama Toon here. Wave to the mum, wave, wave to the people. She's blowing kisses. Why are you blowing kisses? You don't know though. You can't kiss strangers. Yo, people. So today we are finally doing the Q&A. You guys asked for this. You guys hit the community challenge. And Mama Toon is here to answer all the questions that you guys have. So, you know, it's quite it's quite scary because I don't know what you're going to... No, I'm just going to freestyle it. Just wing it. <laughs> I think that's something that we just do, right? We just... We do. Yeah, and we... I might get it wrong, but that's me if they know me. Yes. If they know me. If they know you. I just rock up now and then and I disappear as quick as I come in. Hey, eh? Come on. What is it? What is it? What's it about? What's this? Yes. This is an Udi. This is an Udi. I've been wearing this like for the last three weeks. Yeah. And do we all get one? Do you want to wear one? I'll wear one. All right. You I've got, got one, one to fit we're me? Gonna get, we're going to get mum in an Udi. <laughs> Oh God. It's one of the Disney characters in Roadrunner. Did you say it? Disney? It's not Disney. No, it's not. Oh, is it Looney Tunes? Yes, there you go. Which Looney one is it? Looney it is. It... Normally he's bigger, but yeah. on this one he's a baby, beginning with T. Oh, he's a nutcase, isn't he? Yeah, yeah, um... yeah. Go on. Oh, I don't know, but he's terrible. Ta Tasmanian Devil. Tasmanian Devil. See, she knew it. She just needed the, you know, yeah. little warm up. Wow. All right, people. So here, that's right. Here we go. Here we go. Mum is ready. She is waiting for the first question to come out. Ooh, some ooh, questions ooh. are like shorter. Some questions are quite, you have to think about it. But you just answer the first thing, I guess, that comes to, to, oh, to your head. Okay. All right. Yeah. Uh, question number one. Uh, what is your name? My name? Yasmin. Yasmin Bieber. Yasmin Bieber, okay. Obviously, she's not going to give you a full government name so the whole world knows it can track us down and find us, right? Yes. But you're getting Yasmin Bieber. Why Why Bieber? Bieber, because when I was born, the Art Deco shop, the only one in London in Kensington, was an Art Bieber shop. And if you look her up, you'll see she was a famous designer in her era. Okay. She's famous. She's got a logo. Oh, is that why you get the Bieber watches? I got Bieber watches, Bieber bedding, Bieber towels, Bieber bathroom shop, you name I it. I thought it was Bieber. Handbags. Like Feather boas, evening dresses and gowns. She's got, she's got it all. Even Bieber jeans are she's out there. She's got it all, guys. Yeah. So, you know, when mum's birthday, you know, it's next. Just send me the Bieber. Send her the Bieber. <laughs> question number two, guys. We've got a question here. Question number two. What was your nickname for Baby Toon? So what was the nickname that you used to give me, I guess, when you were younger? Or did you have a nickname for me? No. I named my boys Roman Strong character names. So, so he was our gladiator. Sparta. <laughs> yes. Jonathan. So I was named. I was named and after you're Nicholas, a, a Roman. There's strong Roman strong and Greek Ro names. There's connections. There you so because I had boys, they needed strong names. You want to play with the big boys? <laughs> you want to bamba? You want to cheat with the big boys? All right. Next question here. Um, oh my God. Uh, the question here says, "What is the most embarrassing moment?" that tune ever did um yes when you got bigger 
and you were doing um, something else with the school. They called him in and they wanted him to stand there, 11 years old. No, 10. You were 10. You're the youngest because you're on August birthday. Okay. Yeah, whereas the others are turning 11 to go to secondary school. But in his leaving mass, they wanted him to stand up by himself and sing solo in the front of a big church because it's related to the first because his voice because his voice hadn't broken yet and he had a brilliant voice it still hasn't oh, oh there you go Played but did piano. i do it did i get up did you I did sing? you got up and, and you was allowed to wear trousers that day so you're preparing for secondary school they allowed you to wear and trousers. what happened why was it embarrassing you were embarrassed to do it by yourself but i done it you did it because it was all the church would be full with all the leaving people and all the their parents hmm. all the leaving masses all and right. you had to get up enough. there with the priest as well and the choir um what is the best thing about nick <laughs> the best thing about nick is that he has talent and whatever he puts his mind to he doesn't even realize when he tackles it he tackles it full on and he can achieve it he should have been an entrepreneur and this is the start of one of the things he's business but if he went out there and he did football he went to russia mm -hmm. he succeeded and done really well when you took up um doing salsa dancing <laughs> and redirected it you you were only months in it and they wanted to send oh, you good. off to a foreign country to do dancing competitions yeah and when you anything you he puts his mind to he does it well you've always said that i do you just don't have confidence in yourself i do now you, well this is the start of it my, my nick used to with the parents i'm sitting there to come up and show me another ribbon or another badge <laughs> and he was blue team and it's whenever win because we're winners all the blue <laughs> team used to win everything no l's everything w's no just w's. that year group show them the w they were fantastic show them the w w yeah. what does it mean dub it's a dub, dub. okay yeah. oh my god one. What is the one thing mm. that I do to annoy you? Argue back. He will put up with an argument till the uh, to argue me down. Beat wait, me wait. There's down there's a difference. He... There's a difference between mm. arguing and and debating. So you know, let's All clarify. Right. Well, let's put it this way: because they went to university, <laughs> both my boys, they've got a thing about debating mum down into the ground on any subject and what, especially you think, if they you think want mom, to win an mom argument mum should just always be right mum is always right <laughs> whether she's wrong she's older and wiser. who do you think's more stubborn me or you i'm an aries i didn't I'm ask what what a, i did you're not leo, ask what but no you. you're fire you're leo the lion That's right, Fuego. and i'm fire no 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 you're yeah aries. so That's, two fires aries a fish makes a bonfire <laughs> <laughs> no aries is not a fish it's a ram it's a ram. So Head of the zodiac. Pisces. 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 Yeah. So, what was your reaction to myself becoming a full-time content creator and streaming? What was your like reaction to it? Your first. Well, at first, mm -hmm. I thought, "How is that going to? How are you going to survive?" Because you didn't. I guess you I didn't, didn't understand it, and I didn't know there was a concept to it that it could support a livelihood mm. and then i didn't know because you're all into computers and everything how it would how much you had to put into it but when i knew you did your media mm -hmm. and your filming and photography it all came back it in. all came together and then i could see how it worked yeah. Plus, you had skills when you did your own photography company. That's another thing he did, and it <laughs> did well. And then he had to shut it down because of COVID and stuff. Yeah. And because of yeah, um, what is it? Another company conflict. Conflict with the company. If you worked yeah. for one company, you couldn't run your own business. Yeah, and that was starting to take off as yeah, well. Yeah, so yeah. it's got a lot of diverse angles, but this brings it together. Um, all right. So next question here. Um, did you ever compare Toon and his older brother while growing up? Yes. And what did you compare about us? I didn't compare to your personalities because you are both very different. And who's better? I'm not going into that. Let's be a politician now. I treat all my children fair, even if they don't, <laughs> even though they don't think so, right? But 
their personalities are so different that it, it, it's awkward. So you allow them to, I allow them to be themselves. Even yeah. my daughter's different and I appreciate who they are, but I would nurture what I thought was their talent. But I think that's good. I think that's a good thing that you, yeah. you let us be, be us. There's a difference because I feel like, you know, especially like going to school and like having different friends and like how, I guess what they speak about, like with their families and like everything was so strict, like growing up and it couldn't this and it couldn't and that. And I'm there beating. like- Some of them used to get beatings in the day. I used, to get, I used to get well, beats from oh, dad. That's what you're you talking about. <laughs> well, she used to beat me with the rulers, right? She well, I weren't going to hurt my hand. Yeah. You what see was it? this put, hand? What was it? Put your hand Looking. up. She used to say, put your I hand up. I wasn't going to, yeah, whack. <laughs> And if they don't listen, Granddad used to say they must feel. Do you remember that one? Granddad used to say, if you don't yeah. listen, they must feel. All right. Um, next question here. Uh, we got a question. It says, uh, when you were bringing Tune into the world, mm. did you have any concerns or things you were worried about for his sake? Well, when I pushed him out, I was more worried about, am I ripping apart? You were the smallest, babe. You were the six pounds... <laughs> No, seven I pounds was the six. You were no, Annie was the smallest, but you, medium, were seven pounds six. But do you have any? What did you have any worries of bringing me into the world? Yes, because you were born what? a bit yellow. Yellow? What do you yellow. mean? Yellow. You had a bit of yellow. They said like jaundice, and I had to put you in the sun to give you vitamins. Yellow. Be. I'm the darkest so, of all you the are. kids. Oh yes, and he had a very dark. You know what? what? When the rest of you was pale. The rest of me was pale. I never had the baby. The first baby was pale all over. <laughs> but you, you, were, you were dark below. What did he say? Really <laughs> that there was a deformity there until Auntie Pauline, your dad's sister, came and said to me, Yasmin, haven't you seen that before? And I'm saying, no. It wasn't Jonathan. I say, no. And she goes, oh, it happens, but it changes as you grow up. The way it gets darker. Well, it balances somehow with your body and your other parts. My mum's concern that you was that when wrong. I was born, the colour of my genitals area region it was the balls actually. It was, was the, um. A diff it was really dark, <laughs> dark skin. You want to bamba? Wow. You want to cheat with the big balls? The rest of them so pale. All right, we're moving on to the next. <laughs> All right, next question here. Uh, what was Toon like as a kid? Oh, Toon was very demanding, very hard work, wanted to know everything, be in everything, learn everything. Absorb. Yeah, yeah. no, but just to the point that he would torment you unless he got it or got his own way. Very strong personality and character, very. Was he? You was I see. cheeky? I think the follow-up. You were to this very, was... very cheeky. What is? What's cheeky uh, to no you? Like, cheeky. What, like what you is... would push boundaries, but do it in a like your flattery eyelids. Like you, especially the women. Watch out, women. Right, because he's a bit of a what is it? A phalanger? What? Is it, no, you. What are you using yourself? words that are phalanger? Yeah, that you what? would flirt to get what he want. From primary school, I was called in. <laughs> Now, this is pre-nursery to tell me that Nicholas would get the girls to tie up his pee shoelaces because he wouldn't dress or do it himself. He got the girls to dress him. And I said, well, what am I supposed to do? I said, Damn he, right. Right? And he goes, dress she goes, me. no, he just flutters his eyelids at everyone because he had the big, beautiful eyes. Look at him. Right? <laughs> and then... They say, and then he would make the girls do everything for him. I was so shocked because I didn't know how he behaved at school. And, uh, and this is primary uh, level. This oof. is inf no infant <laughs> level. Like I was some masquerade. Yeah, but you, you make it sound like yeah. I'm like with some. No, but pimp, from some no, pimp in school. No, you just like, believe like I dressed you as a mother. You thought he carried on when you started nursery preschool. Shouldn't have dressed me. Even when you wanted, well, no, what about they, when you wanted you, you an 18th shouldn't have dressed birthday me. party? You shouldn't have dressed me. When you were little, who else should have dress you? You should have gave me the socks and underpants should have and said, beat you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so next question here is, what is your favourite thing that Toon has ever created? Ooh. First thing that comes to your mind. Your photography. Your photography? Your photography was amazing. 
he's got he takes such pictures that the moods you show the moods you the p pictures itself and mm. the people like when you did Lake Garda and the wedding mm -hmm. and then when you did Annalise before Halloween was it mm -hmm. and you had her sitting on a log and the colors like opal skies behind her with her fiery hair you just get yeah, it right I do you just I think like I do very I, artistic I do miss the photography side of things yeah. I feel like with doing all the content creation it's been hard to try and figure out when's the time to start doing it again mm. next question here um, has Tuna ever cooked for you? If so, what was the favourite dish? Yes, you have cooked for me. You've done quite a mixed dish, I think, is it? With chicken and rice. Like a cook-up that has vegetables in it, chicken and rice. But quite spicy. And that was quite delicious. Spicy. Do yeah. you like spicy food? I do. I like yeah. it spicy and tasty but not too hot that kills it yeah high five way, high five way, because way, because way. <laughs> because the reason why i say that is because every time we talk about spice in the community and in the chat I, they feel like i don't like spice but i tell them that i do but it's got to be the right amount ah, when it's too yes. too too hot mm. i don't enjoy the food yeah so when i make my food it's normally always tasty with like a kick to it yes but not to the point that, that it's gonna yeah yeah it so. takes away the taste of the food all right another question here um says mama tune uh when are we going clubbing together Oh. That was from uh, Night King. He's asking. Uh, and are we... you in the UK? He is in the UK. Oh, are you in London? He is in London. Oh, we can organise a party in Camden. And he, and he likes um, vodka. Oh, I like vodka. Do you do? I like vodka and lemon or lemonade. Anything with lemon. Oh, Night King, there you go, you know. What is something you would have done different when becoming a parent? Ooh. I would not do anything different. I treated each one of my children as in their personalities. Mm. And I've always been there, good or bad, and supported them. I said, and if anything happens, I'm there for them. While I've got breath in my body, it's what we do. I'm an Aries. I'm a mother first. Mother! Yay! Mother power! Shout out to mothers everywhere! <laughs> Yay! Um, They're the soul of the family, guys. Treat them with respect. What what things were you grateful for when you first became a mum? Oh, that's hard. I was grateful that I had three beautiful, healthy children. Yes. And they didn't give me any trouble like I know other people's children did. And they put their trust in me to do whatever I did necessary to get them through schooling and to the stage they are now mm. and i'm so appreciated well, that kind of and grateful that i've actually got them through university all of them they've got degrees what kind of things do you think tune got from you oh be stubbornness <laughs> strong personality artisticness mm-hmm I gave them all a bit of art. I dragged them all over the place when mm -hmm. they were young. And you used to do dancing when you were young. Yes, I won a competition there. Yeah. And you used to roller skate. And I used to roller skate in the day mm -hmm. in Covent Garden but and you just Jubilee Hall. didn't play and video games. Hall. Video you played games. dominoes. I played dominoes. I and blackjack. And chess. And blackjack. You know, she played. Yeah, black, you know, I beat. Yeah, that's how I met your dad. <laughs> I used to beat the guys in my lunch break in London. I run up and play blackjack with them a couple of games, and it used to pay really him. Yeah, some of your I mum and dad's win. probably lost to my mum. You know, yeah. she probably took, took their money. Now I don't know what's happened. I don't do any of that, do I? No, you chill no, now. I just let it leave it to the next generation. <laughs> All right, so our last question, the last question on the Q and A that we've received. Um, is basically can Mama Toon show us any baby pictures of Toon? So, do you have photos on you? I've got one right in front of me on my phone, and it's when <laughs> he started school at three and a half. When I was telling you, oh he was getting my the God. girls were yeah, dressing yeah. you. So, was that my first day at school? Your first day at school, and your brother was four days, and I'm out in the rain there. So who took the photo, Dad? Dad's on the other side of the car. What did you What did you take the photo with then? Was it with those? Um, you know those cameras where you had to. Yes, 
Yeah. Uh, there's like Kodak little cameras. Yeah. Um, what other, how many photos do you have on here? Oh, I've got so many. What's Thank that you. one? That's Christmas. Christmas. I like how me and um, Jay are matching right there. Oh, so easy. What it is that? Is it, is it a dressing gown? I don't even know what you It's a dressing in. gown. One oh of those little posh God. fleece ones with red and royal colours. So they're all warm. What are we yeah. holding? Is it swords? Swords. You've opened loads of stuff that you got for Christmas. <laughs> and I'm like, it's everywhere. But I haven't seen these. That's crazy. Someone took this. I remember the bed covers, though. I remember yeah, you those. had... The bunk red. beds yeah. but you had the covers and the primary colors were in then and you're children yeah. uh, have you got one more let's see if we yeah, got one, one more, more in there it. oh <laughs> oh my god when he became his dad oh, <laughs> his dad tried to convert him let's have a look. to a chelsea fan and you were in jamaica i haven't I actually you were in, seen this it, I actually were you in jamaica or america this is jamaica this is jamaica and he's in the he's wrapped a chelsea towel because as soon as he was born his dad put a chelsea scarf around his penis area to take a picture in the hospital bed and as you got bigger every time he got chelsea he just plonked you in it you, you didn't have a choice look that, at the stance i look so strong you're ready to go that's what i said you weren't quiet that look, he looks really cheap and he was there. a natural swimmer is. that is you right guys that is it the q a is finished thank you so much for my mum coming on to Yay. absolutely do this with us today Hopefully, you know, it's not the last time you see my mum might be doing more challenges together. So you Valentine's. never know. Chinese New Year. Okay, I, don't, no. I don't know about that. Mother's but, Day. Yeah, guys, we're out here now. Like, comment and subscribe to the channel. And guess what? I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Take it easy. Bye.